I've got this uh, car parking lot here and what we want to do is regrade it so that all the water flows down to the curb. Let's assume it hasn't been asphalted yet and that we've just turned up on site and there's no design so we're going to do a quick infield design. The first step is we're going to now jump into SiteWorks. So what we're going to do is go around and measure all these curbs that we just saw. So I'm going to select, I'm going to go new line, I'm going to call this a brake line around the outside and accept and I'm going to go ahead and measure my points. <laughs> So now that we've uh, surveyed the outside of our um, curb, we want to actually set a high point uh, where we get, where all the water will flow down from into the curb. So at the moment, you can see that the water, the we've got the blue point is the high on the 3D model, and the red is the low point. But I want to make it so some of the water is going to flow to the blue point. So what I need to do is add some infield design elements. I can really simply do that by making measuring a line right here in the middle of my design. So I'm measuring a brake line through here and this is going to be the high point of my grading. What I want to do is turn on point elevations to see which points, what elevation I want to set. So you can see in the top here of my high point I've got an elevation of 1647.999 and I want water to flow down to that so I'm going to simply edit this point down here where my point is and I'm going to make that 1648 2. And that's saved. So we've got point 2 above it. And in this case, I've decided I'm going to edit this other end to point 2. And I'll change that to elevation. And let's make that the same. Made my high points for my design. What I'm now going to do is convert this uh, measured data into an infield design. I can do that really simply. Go to the main menu, go to data management, and go surface as design. My do, new design is going to be called finished grade. In this case I'm going to include the measured line work. I'm going to use the outermost points and I've created that. Now I need to go to my project setup and pick my design. Now I've got my design, what I want to do is actually go to my design and set my contours. And you can see here I've, I can turn on and off my design contours, and in this case I'm going to set them at a 0.1 interval. And so now, by doing my contours, I can verify that all my water from my high point is going to flow down to my curb line that I just measured. So looking at this uh, 2D view, you can see that uh, I might want to do some more work now to tidy up some of the contours. Uh, at the moment you can see where my triangles are created and the contours aren't really smooth so maybe I'll go create some more brake lines. A pretty simple process to do this is by going into the menu, Kogo, and create points in arcs. 
and I'm going to create a new line so I want to create my line from there to that line there and I've created it as a break line which is good accept that uh, let's go another one from there to say that corner accept that from there to this far corner here accept that and from there to this corner and accept that and now what I want to do is regenerate my design surface so data management surface as design and in this case I'm going to call it finish grade version 2 I'm going to include my design line work this time accept that use outermost points accept and then I can simply go and change my project to finish grade 2 and once I've selected that you can see I have some contours which are really nicely graded and that looks like a better model than what I previously had and I've got it in my 3D view as well and so now I've got a really good uh, infield design uh, the, it's looking like it's ready to go and grade so I can put that on the machine and that's really simple tip on the main menu go to data management go to export to machine up the top here I'm going to select design and you can see my active design is finished grade version 2 and I can tap accept and send that to the machine